This unboxing is something new to me. I never had an ex I never had experienced this kind uh, before, so it's kind of weird or strange, or I'm not sure if it's even bad or something. Uh, so it's somehow like a roller coaster ride. Uh, started out as something very exciting, like I'm super excited. Then downfalls into something uh, this very very disappointing, and ended up as the best experience of customer service I had for a very long time for a collectible and that's why it's so amazing so check it out so there's actually two boxes let's try to open first the uh, the big one or the heavier one uh, the other one is quite light. I think this might be the, the switch out box, but okay, let's let's do this. That was the other box, I guess it's the base and the body. So let's try to open this one. So uh, I'm finally able to open it and um, basically this is the lighter box which I was right it's mostly the head so I think there are seven or six I think seven and this is more or less the body so these are the two boxes look at that um, this one is a bit heavier though so I'm very excited to open this up um, just one last look of the boxes opened then let's start getting this assembled I have already placed the base here um, it was okay uh, not a problem uh, putting it in or bringing it out from the box that which is quite good I thought it would be that heavy like really heavy it's not which is okay at least I won't have any problem lifting it so let's get the body So the body is actually has a very good weight. I love that the body has weight. I think based on the size, uh, it has a very good weight. And I love the weathering, amazing. The texture, the details. This is, wow, this is amazing. I, I'm, I'm just freaking out like how good it is, just the body itself. So let me try to continue to assemble. a bit um, I think I should have placed this one first I think so before putting it in like that so what I love about the body is it snugs perfectly like perfectly and I don't have any problem I really didn't have any problem with it uh, like removing or anything that is just awesome Wow perfect look at that there you go. Wow. 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 This piece looks pretty awesome, uh, honestly, but as awesome as it is, it has a very big issue. So, as you can see, I could not place two things in this arm. Um, one is the tentacles and the other one is the magnet. The tentacles, the peg hole doesn't seem to fit the, the peg itself um, or the key, sorry, the key uh, doesn't 
seem to fit in the keyhole and the magnet in the hand itself seems like it has a reverse polarity because when I push it in or let's say snug it in it, it repels <laughs> the hand so I have to contact the guy who sold, sold me this one um, the guy who made this basically I have to check with him so I, I, I couldn't continue with this one I wanted to change all the heads anyway I'll show you the different heads because there's a lot of different heads and it looks amazing there was no issues for that one only I guess they are I think the entire left arm has a problem so yeah turns out I was wrong about two things first is the tentacles I was totally wrong about only having two tentacles uh, because I think I didn't look at the box so when I had the discussion with the uh, commissioner he told me that check the box there's a lot of different tentacles I know there was so that was kind of part of my complaint and I thought that there was no other ten tentacles and yeah actually I found it it's in another layer of the box which I did not check so I have there's actually a lot of tentacles I think six pairs plus one in for his um, how would say right arm uh, and that, it's amazing there's a lot and like I my favorite are this ones I, the ones I place right now and I will show you in a while the all these tentacles some of the details I will even show you more during the, the review itself so these are the tentacles as you can see they're quite a lot so uh, in here this is like five bears and additionally there is this one which is is in the right hand or the right arm and that is with the wolverine i guess skeleton uh it's pretty amazing there's a lot of them honestly i, I don't need all of them i just need one pair uh, and then that's it but yeah these are the switch outs for the tentacles pretty awesome as well at least you get a lot of options if you want to so the next thing I was wrong about was also the the magnets in the hand so I thought that there was a problem with the arm uh, because the magnets doesn't uh, magnetize um, meaning it was the polarity was reversed uh, so I called the commissioner and uh, we had a video call and I would say at that time that would be I would consider as the best fan art customer service for a piece amazing uh, so we had a discussion we we wanted or he wanted to investigate what is actually the problem so we checked and and he like i said he was the one who told me that there are a lot of tentacles so we did we tried a lot of stuff investigated try rever reversing and everything and it turns out that the arm was not a problem the problem was actually in the hand so the hands has the magnets were in the hands i guess were reversed um i don't know what happened to that or anything though they kind of reversed and i said and that was the disappointing part because i cannot fix it on my own uh i guess i can do something about the tentacles like i said there were only two and i was kind of okay okay fine that, that, that's fine for me that this tentacles doesn't really fit because i have a lot more that that fits the problem for me at that point was actually the, the hands so what happens is that he said I get back to you let me find a solution after a few days I think or a, even a day I, I totally forgot now he contacted me and told me that okay the solution would be I find an artist here in Singapore and basically he did and he had a deal with him and now as you can see, uh, the artist, uh, I mean, yeah, the artist actually reversed. I, I don't know what he did, but I guess he reversed the magnets or something. And now it works. So all I need to do, uh, all I did was send it to the artist. He changed it. Uh, actually, I sent the, the two tentacles, the left arm, and the two hands. And that was it. Uh, and then it came back after like a week and a half, I think, if I'm correct, or two weeks. Less than two weeks for sure, and I didn't have to pay anything. That was amazing. This is the head switch outs. Um, I'll show you guys a bit close, some close up, a quick close up on them. There you go. Pretty amazing. Um, I did try all of them. 
Um, some didn't fit that well, but it, it's okay. I mean, it's not super snug, but everything is okay, I would say. Um, I, I don't see any problems so far. It's just that there are too many. I don't know where to put them. Uh, but it's amazing that you get all these options. Uh, the one that I placed is the screaming one um, in the card, uh, in the piece itself. So yeah. I've always been on reserve for fan arts uh, for one main reason not because uh, there are some like uh, some I don't like but most of the fan arts are pretty amazing really good it's just that the customer service when there's an issue that's always what I am afraid of um, that they might not be able to deliver that service um, and I might not like it or something and it just creates a lot of problems because I'm always used to licensed companies where uh, customer service like Sideshow, I've, I never had a problem with Sideshow. They've been very decisive with their well, when they say something and I, they just need some pictures or videos and then something like that. Then they take care of you in regards to those things. And they're, they've done it in a very timely manner compared to other companies. I, I, I like Sideshow better. But for uh, fine arts, that's always my concern. But for this one, at least I didn't have any other problems with other fan arts that I have, but for this one, I was it was better than Sideshow. Like the commissioner talked to me, discussed, tried to investigate. Yeah, it's laborsome, but I did enjoy it. I learned a lot of stuff. Um, honestly, I learned a lot of stuff and it was fun. Uh, yeah, tiring a bit, but it was really fun. And to top it all off, I didn't pay anything. Yeah, I spent time, but again, it was fun. I didn't pay anything it was all with the commissioner amazing stuff and that's why I have to thank you for the commissioner of this one it's really an amazing piece and I do wish don't keep asking me what's the rating again during the investigation uh, that's just a funny thought though so yo I think he really wanted to know how I, I think about this piece so like I said it's pretty amazing really good uh, top of my list to be honest in my uh, collection and also thank you for Yuli again for really fixing this one. Thank you for that. So again, if you like this video, click the thumbs up and help me share with everyone. And as always, if you have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe to the Engine's Play so you get you get uh, weekly pop culture videos like this one right now, unboxing and reviews and everything else. So thank you for watching. Stay tuned here in Engine's Place.